Elena with Manatee County Parks and Natural Resources. Welcome to Explorers Academy. Do you enjoy the outdoors? Did you know that you could turn your passion for nature into a career? Today we are going to discover the variety of nature related professions that will take you outside. Many of these careers involve conserving some of the world's most precious resources like water, air, and trees. Forestry professionals use their expertise in biology, engineering, and physics to manage and improve our forest lands. These experts must not only be able to see individual trees, but also the whole forest. When developing management plans, they consider the land usage, wildlife, soil, water, and other plants in the area that help support a healthy forest environment. As part of creating these plans, forestry professionals are also tasked with monitoring and administering prescribed fires. Prescribed fires are an important part of Florida's natural ecosystem. Especially in the scrub habitat, fire is necessary for plants to grow, seeds to sprout, to eliminate built up piles of fuel, and to maintain the habitat for resident wildlife. Forestry professionals are vital in helping our ecosystems maintain a healthy balance. Manatee County, our ecological and marine resources team members are experts in the field of marine science, biology, ecology, and botany. They work to restore habitat in our local preserves and marine waterways. Hi, I'm Kristen Erickson. I'm the Marine Resources Coordinator for Parks and Natural Resources Department. Our program oversees the abandoned vessels, aids to navigation, which ties into manatee protection efforts, boat ramps and artificial reefs. So we have a lot to cover. A big part of it for me is the artificial reef program because we don't have a funding source for that. So typically we have to find the funding through donations or um, doing a lot of grant applications. And then we manage those projects. We create the actual reef. We then in turn do the monitoring that we have to um, do uh, according to the permit once the project is complete. Kristen Erickson, Parks and Natural Resources Marine Resources Coordinator, turned her passion for nature into an amazing career. My first experience in the ocean was when my parents brought me to Florida and we were on the East Coast. I was able to go snorkeling and see an actual reef and the fish and all of the amazing things that I didn't even know what they were, but it was, it, it was amazing to me and I wanted to know more. And that was one thing that I really started to, as I got a little bit older, realize that I was more interested in the specific um, niche or the specific thing that each organism played in its overall environment. The ocean just hooked me. And I realized that as I was working my way through school, um, I was more and more interested in mammalogy and zoology and a career in marine science was really my way to turn my love of nature into my job, into my career. Knowing that I'm working in this field to improve our environment, again, that we share through science, conservation, and education. That's the most rewarding part to me. Erin Struzeri, Parks and Natural Resources, Ecological Resources Coordinator, knew from a young age that she wanted to make a difference in the natural world. My name is Erin Struzeri. I'm an Ecological Resources Coordinator with Manatee County Parks and Natural Resources. My day-to-day -day job is basically managing ecosystem restoration projects throughout Manatee County. I first wanted to get involved in environmental science when I was in middle school. Um, I saw, learned about the Exxon Valdez oil spill and I decided I wanted to do something to help nature and the animals, but I didn't know how that would quite manifest itself until I um, was out of, well out of college. The most rewarding part of my job is finishing a project, um, signing off on completion of a newly created ecological habitat and just seeing the animals instantly come back to the native plants and the oyster bars and they just 
instantly take up residence in these new areas and it's pretty great to see. Ecological and marine resources professionals have exciting fun careers that help make the natural world a better place. Wildlife biologists investigate how animals, plants, and other organisms interact with their natural environment and with each other. They use the data they collect to develop management plans that may help improve wildlife populations. Many fish and wildlife professionals are experts not only in biology, ecology, and environmental studies, but also in political science, sociology, and economics. These professionals must effectively communicate their studies and management strategies to the public and to policymakers who may be putting laws in place to protect land and wildlife. Additionally, fish and wildlife professionals may be part of law enforcement, helping to ensure the public is following the laws that help keep human wildlife interactions safe. If you enjoy observing animals in their natural environment and are dedicating to protecting and conserving wildlife, this may be the career path for you. Environmental educators like myself are dedicated to communicating the unique and fascinating qualities of the natural world to the public. Many environmental educators have a passion for working not only with wildlife, but also with people. They develop and deliver programs to encourage citizens to get out in nature and learn about their local wildlife and how to conserve it. Environmental educators may also lead recreational activities, such as kayaking, archery, and fishing. If you want to ignite the nature-loving spark in others, make the outdoors your classroom and become an environmental educator. Geoscientists research the Earth's physical environment, including its soils, minerals, oceans, and atmospheres. They often work on measuring global climate change or assist with locating adequate supplies of natural resources, such as petroleum, groundwater, and metals. Geoscientists can advise on the sustainability of our natural resources and make recommendations on how to properly manage their usage. Careers in this field often take researchers around the world, sometimes for weeks at a time to remote locations for data and sample collection. While in the field, geologists may be camping, hiking, or out at sea. The work of geoscientists is changing the world. If you want to be a part of that change and are up for an adventure, a career in geoscience might be for you. Environmental engineers use their expertise in engineering, math, soil science, biology, and chemistry to develop solutions to environmental problems. These issues could be anything from public health to air pollution to global issues like climate change. These professionals spend time working with city planners, builders, and environmental scientists to study, create, and design systems that solve complicated dilemmas. Put your math and problem solving skills to the test and become an environmental engineer. We are surrounded by unique opportunities to enjoy the outdoors. Why not make a career out of it? No matter which nature career path you choose, make sure you have one thing, a passion for making a difference. We hope you learned a lot about nature careers today and hope you'll join us next time.